Hey everybody, welcome back to my garden. And today I want to show you an update with the tomato plants. Over here we have the black vernissage, beautiful looking tomato plant. It's doing really healthy. It's about, I would say, maybe like a foot and a half tall right now. Or just about the height of the, the cucumber trellis. So if I back up a bit, you could see just how big it is. And it's being grown in a one gallon mason jar. Sorry, the other cucumber plant is a little bit in the way. You can see it right that right there a little bit better. And this thing is growing very tight and condensed, which is fantastic. Normally when I've grown tomato plants, they've been a little bit more leggy. And I'm referring to the distance between the base of the plant as well to in between the branches. And you can see that it's starting to flower now. Right over here, the flowers, two of them have already pollinated yesterday, I seen they were open so I gave it a little bit of a shake. You can just come in and give it a little bit of a tap. But as well as I have the fan going, that's actually two fans right now that are running at the same time so you can see the plant is moving constantly and just that shaking alone will pollinate the plant. Or you can come in and give the whole plant a little bit of a shake, that works really well too. You can see the second plant, the, the green vernissage, it's also uh, creating flowers over here, but it's nowhere near the size of the plant. It's about half the size. Now, this is greatly due to the fact that it ran out of nutrient solution. You, you guys probably seen a video of that that I posted before. Now you can see just how different the two plants look. The one in the back is looking super big and healthy, and the one up front, although it's looking a little bit sad. These leaves, it took a long time for it to bounce back. It, just think it, it almost took about a week, I think, for this thing to come back to life completely. So I'm monitoring its growth. It's doing pretty well. I put it back on. It had it outside of the lights. This way it was able to bounce back. These lights are pretty intense. I actually just ordered a ventilation system as well as a few other things that I'm going to be adding and changing in here. So we'll make up a video about that when it comes in. But for now, I notice there's basically two sets of flowers that are growing. There's one right there, the second one is over here. And there's even some suckers that are beginning to form right here in between the weeds and the branches. So I'm really excited about that. I'm not sure if I should clip those or just let it grow naturally yet. I'm going to debate. I'm going to see it and how that goes. I'll decide probably as it's growing. I may even take some transplants and create a couple more plants that really saves you on time instead of starting from seed again that'll save you probably like about a month and a half of just growth alone and I don't want to disturb the root system too much right now so we'll skip that we'll probably show that in a later episode when the plant gets a little bit bigger but overall it's doing really well the both tomato plants are looking great they're loving the heat right now it's currently 90 degrees I just turned the lights on about an hour ago you can see it's generally, it reaches about 102, which is a huge reason why I need this um, ventilation system in here. These fans, although they're blowing lots of air around, it's just a bunch of hot air basically, so you can see the tomatoes are loving it. Cucumber plants suffering a bit. The fruits are not able to mature and grow. Fortunately, it's putting out a bunch of fruits all over, but I've yet to have one that takes, so hopefully when that new system comes in, I'm going to be able to really have a boost in growth. And for now, that's all I want to show you guys. There's not much else that's going on. Oh, before we go, actually, um, you could see the plant that we, the tomato plant that we planted on the 3rd of June. It actually just popped up. Yesterday, I noticed it was coming up, and today, I was outside for a few hours. I just got back, so now it's time to put this thing under the lights. So I'm just going to find a little spot over here. And that's going to grow for a little bit, and then we're going to transplant that into a hydroponic system as soon as it gets in the mail. I'm going to be transplanting most of these plants into 5 gallon buckets. I'll show you guys that step by step how I do that when it comes. And for now, if you liked the episode, don't forget to hit the thumbs up and subscribe. Thanks for watching.